I might be late to the GameStop Black Friday mystery box uh, unboxings, but I guarantee it's just because I'm cheap and these things always go on sale. So I waited it out, and sure enough, we got two. They went on sale for half off, and then it was buy one, get one half off, so they come out to like $9 and some change each. And I didn't like all of the items that were in this mystery box, so for the chance of getting the two pops I want, I figured it was a good time to wait until they're on sale, so let's have at it. These just showed up on a rainy New Year's Eve. Happy New Year's, everyone. And the two that I'm actually looking for, I grew up with all these Disney cartoons that are within these boxes. Uh, the two I'm looking for are the Megavolt from Darkwing Duck, because the chase is a glow-in-the-dark. So out of the five pops in these, every single one has a chase version. Glow-in-the-dark, I'm a sucker for that, as you all probably know if you've been watching the channel. I love to show off glow-in-the-dark pops. The other one that I'm hoping to possibly get would be the chase of the Monterey Jack from Chippendale's Rescue Rangers. It's where Monterey smells cheese and goes, cheese! So, let's see what we got. You can hear the, the jangling around of some pins or something. Up first, ta-da! We've got a chase of Wildcat from Tailspin. And Tailspin's another show I actually really, really did enjoy. It's just the chase is just where he's got some grease because he's the mechanic. So a little bit different of a paint job. Makes me think kind of of the Ren and Stimpy chases. We've got a plush. The button that was making all the noise. The Goof Troop button. And then these are supposed to be glow-in-the-dark stars. And Pez, which I do not care about. Boo Berry. So this we're going to show in a second. Let's see what's in box number two. Hopefully it's not the same thing. But will we get another chase? It is Monterey Jack like I wanted, but it's not the chase version where he's freaking out over the cheese. So still a cool pop, though. The other plush. So now we got a set of those. More one of our stars. Another Goof Troop pen. And the same stupid Pez that I just do not care about. So didn't even get a different one. But that's alright. What I'm always in it for is the Pops. And we scored one Chase. And one normal Pop. So let's go ahead and uh, pop open Wildcat. So, no stand on him. This is actually a pretty neat pop. So the splatter for the chase version aside, check out his long ponytail. That is kind of neat. You don't often get the pops that are male pops with long hair that's not just the standard bushy, you know, fat head pop. And his tail is coming up there on the side and kind of connecting the two together. His fingers got a little grime on him too, which is kind of cool. There's the bottom, and like I said, there's no stand on this one, so I'm curious to see how well he balances. We'll check him out in a second. He's already falling over on the desk. So, Chippendales Rescue Rangers. Now I'm really curious why GameStop got all these shows, the cartoons. Now they're not game related. I don't know. I'm just happy they were on sale. So I put the link down there in the bottom as well if you want to check it out. They still have these for sale. You can still get the deals. There's Monterey Jack holding his cheddar. Got his little mouse tail. Now the neck on this one is really weird. Got his goggles above his head, which is kind of cool. No stand on this one either, so we'll see how he balances. But look at that neck. It's kind of like a weird, let's try this side. It's kind of a, a weird connector peg. So, kind of an odd head. But, I love Monterey Jack, and those are the two. We got the chase of Wildcat and Monterey Jack. Thanks for watching.